Brentwood. Today I'm going to be reading you a book called We're All Works of Art. And in this book it introduces lots of different styles of artwork and it talks about how different and unique each style is just like us. Because think about it, how boring would the world be if we were all the same? Enjoy the book. I miss you guys. We're All Works of Art. Written by Mark Sparing and illustrated by Rose Blake. Our faces might seem angular with noses all askew. Our skin tones might all vary where every shade and hue. Some people think we look surreal and frankly, yes we do. But we can make you tilt your head and see the world anew. Our feet might be so heavy they root us to the floor, but we have a certain presence that no one can ignore. We might look rather classic or something else less so. We might look quite familiar or like any, like no one else you know. Our bodies might all differ in shape and form and frame. But think how dull the world would be if we were all the same. We might look like a collage made up from this and that. But we wouldn't change a mismatched ear or swap one single scrap. Whoever it was that made us made us each with loving care. Each curve and kink and scribbly line was meant to be right there. We are proud of our uniqueness and deep down in our hearts, we know that we are spectacular. For we're all works of art. In this book, they showed us lots of different styles of art. Some of them might look familiar to you. We studied prehistoric art, Egyptian art, Greek art, Indian miniatures, Renaissance art, Fauvism and Cubism. There was a little bit of surrealism and pop art, contemporary art as well. Was there one that you liked the best? <laughs> 